Well, you've seen this spot once before, but anyway, yesterday, <laughs> just to explain the title, yesterday nothing worked, right? Nothing. I mean, nothing. Oh, didn't feel very good and tried all sorts. Anyway, we've had the Clio MOT'd, right? So we've got it for another year. Well, whatever. Maybe not. Um, until someone runs into me again. You know, anyway, we've got it done. I just wanted to tell you that. Uh, that was not yesterday, much Tuesday rather. Tuesday, not yesterday. So, I thought what I'll do is, what I was going to do yesterday, by the way, remember the siren I got? Let me just show you it. Remember the siren I got? Well, I thought, oh, I'll put it on. We've had a test, haven't we? Well, the first thing that happened, look under the bonnet. Look, no room, right? <laughs> no room for it. So that didn't work. Anyway, I spent the afternoon wiring it up and uh, <laughs> spent the afternoon wiring it up uh, and I thought I'll have it you know just leave it like this got a bit of wire and that and I can put it under the car and just use it that way no <laughs> the remote didn't work I only bought it for that so <laughs> but that's oh the other thing I wanted a plug couldn't get one so I got one of those you know that uh, USB ones, took it to pieces and cut a bit of wood and washed it and I've got it so it connects right in there so now if it's connected what we have to do is turn the ignition on and <laughs> use it as a switch like that so I'm just going to have a play with it and I'll probably get to my Anyway, enough of this. What I'm going to do, it's a lovely day, and it's quite warm and I'm feeling okay. I've just called to see a tractor friend of mine. He's not old, not very good, but uh, you've seen his tractors and that. And they were in, which is nice. So far it's quite good. So what I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to take you for a little ride along a road that you haven't seen before. Well, after breaking my camera mount, uh, I've got a new one, a little shorter. So I thought I'd just come out and show you this for a test. The problem is, I noticed this last time, uh, it wants to be, I've got it at the top of the windscreen, uh, I've got it, you know, so you're in the passenger seat, but it really, the camera wants tipping forward slightly. As you can see, uh, the sky makes everything a little dark that's the only thing so as I say this is a we have to test these things anyway what I've got to tell you well this weekend it's Fir Park Wings and Wheels and it's on three days apparently and uh, well, Brad said Saturday and Sunday anyway you can look it up online and it's a very interesting place and my boating friend Steve lives at Caister and it's in between and I've passed it for the last 15 years you know I've been passing it many times never knowing what was there well you see you see Brad uh, with his muggy thousand well he went early in the year and I went well what a place they could they collect all sorts you know they've got an old aeroplane there and trucks and lorries it's like an old-fashioned scrapyard you know so I'm going to take the camera along and show you it now the other thing to tell you, this road at Wispington, um, now when I was 17 I went to work at A Churches at Horncastle as an agricultural engineer and shortly after that um, he bought another farm and he was the 
the first of the intensive farms and they've put them back now look but he he ripped all the hedgerows up and ploughed to the very edge of the road you know and I always remember that someone came to work one of the maybe workmates came to work and he said oh all craven land all over the road so it's <laughs> it was causing much soil erosion which is why they've now paid all the farmers to replant the hedges again you know not only for wildlife for everything you know so that's one of the things and uh, there's other thing you know I can tell you other tales from uh, the farm there there's lots of lots of stories that I can remember from me of anyway I've had quite a good day today I've been out and shown you this and as I said I I called to see me uh, tractor friends because I don't get to see them nowadays and we'll see what we can find but as I say I, I didn't take the camera to Fur Park the last time no idea it was there so if something of quite a bit of interest to show you this weekend I think right I'll leave you with that and uh, let you just enjoy a little bit more of this nice road and Lincolnshire countryside <laughs> 